Hello everybody and welcome to another edition of Beyond Main Street the video cast. Hope everybody's doing good out there today. This kind of sounding like an in your ears experience now isn't it? <laughs> Maybe we could call this an in your ears experience video cast today. But no we're not going to do that. We are actually uh, what is this episode 70 of Beyond Main Street the video cast. And uh, this is actually part three in the Animal Kingdom series. Now, uh, basically, why am I doing audio right now? Right now, I'm gonna keep my segment very short, and I uh, I have a piece of paper here in front of me that has a list of activities at the uh, Animal Kingdom Lodge, both for the Jambo House and for Kidani Village. And uh, instead of you know kind of reading off of these and have you guys see me read these I'm just going to uh, well I am gonna read them however uh, it's just gonna be a little bit more visual instead of having you guys watch me look down at this paper so uh, I'll just flash up uh, on the screen some pictures and um, uh, also uh, just some text of what I am reading so uh, but I think I still have a pretty cool show for you guys. Uh, like I said, this is the third and final miniseries part of the Animal Kingdom Lodge. Uh, one of the very cool things about Animal Kingdom Lodge, and you know, honestly, they might do a lot of this at other resorts. Uh, I'm not quite sure. We haven't taken advantage of many uh, any of the other resorts that we've stayed at. But they have activities like. Um, you know that that kids can do, and I think even some adults can do. Although although we've never done strictly adult activities quite yet. Uh, for example, here I'm looking at the Jambo House list of activities, and the activities run anywhere between nine o'clock in the morning up until eight thirty, nine o'clock at night. So, and they pretty much go all day, uh, every day. Um, for example, let me just go through a couple of Jambo House. We have, uh, you know, like at 10.30 a.m. they have animal tracking. It's uh, basically you can help track uh, our friend Donald using scientific research equipment. And they uh, start that, like I said, at 10.30 a.m. at the Arusha Rock at the Jambo House. Uh, just jumping through, they have cookie decorating. Uh, join Boma staff to decorate your own cookie. We have done that a couple times actually. Uh, you just meet at Boma at 1 p.m. Now these times are changing all the time. So, uh, you know, make sure when you check in to the Animal Kingdom that you ask for the uh, activities list. I believe when you get your huge packet of things, it's always in there anyway. And that's regardless if you're staying uh, through DVC or not. Um... You know, they have African Games and Crafts at the uh, pool deck from 3 to 4. Uh, they have a culinary tour. Join a cultural representative on a tour of our award-winning restaurants, Boma Jico, uh, and discover the flavors of Africa. Uh, that's, you know, like 4 o'clock in the afternoon. Uh, the video segment that I'm playing today is from the Primal Parade. Shake, beat, or rattle African instruments as you follow our parade through the lobby. Now, I recorded that. We did that, ooh, last year or sometime. Uh, I believe it was, like, in the spring. I think, yeah, 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 yeah. I think it was in the spring. Or it might have been when we were there in January. No, I think it was last year. Well, regardless, that's usually in the early evening, 6.30, 7 o'clock. Um, now, we haven't done any activities over at Kidani Village. However, they still have a very good list. Like I said, still starting around 9 o'clock and going till about 9 o'clock at night. Uh, one here they have is called Camp Kidani. Spend time with one of our cultural representatives having fun and learning about wildlife and African cultures. This two-hour program is open to children between the ages of 6 and 12. No oh, bummer. Through complimentary... Uh, although complimentary... Through the end of June, space is limited. Be, uh, please sign up with a safari guide in the lobby or library from 12 p.m. to 8 p.m. Or call an extension for more information. Uh, African by Design. Uh, learn the story behind the design of Disney's Animal Kingdom Lodge. This sounds very cool. Uh, hosted by one of the cultural representatives there. Uh, they have pin trading. Uh, do you like to pin trade pins? Are you looking for that special pin? 
Well, then check out all the pin trading. Uh, check out the pin trading board at the Johari Treasures um, inside the uh, Kidana Village lobby. Uh, they have board game nights Sunday, Tuesday, and Thursday at the Community Hall, where you can play games: Battleship, Candyland, Yahtzee, Trivia Pursuit, blah blah blah. Uh, let's see. Um, okay, here's one: the Drum Cafe. Join us in the library for this adult-focused activity. Learn how to play drums with Afritude. From our African cultural, from our African cultural representatives. All right, that's pretty cool. That's an adult one. And uh, they have story time. They have an African journey. Watch the spirit of Africa come alive and hear about the life and culture of Africa. Uh, another one. Let me go back to Jimbo House. Uh, another one that we had done. Um, I passed it up. Well, basically. Uh, you get to go into the sunset room, and it's usually around 5, 6 o'clock. Hmm. Anyway, you can uh, go in and learn about some of the cast members who uh, are from Africa, and um, they talk about uh, where they grew up and, you know, what the cult culture is like there compared to here. And things like that. Uh, very cool. I've done that actually a couple times. So I I highly recommend definitely staying at Animal Kingdom Lodge uh, and taking up on some of these activities. I personally am a very strong theme park person. I mean, I love Walt Disney theme parks, but um, I'll be honest. I really haven't done anything at the lodge that I haven't really enjoyed. Uh, once, you know, when I'm in the parks, it's like, uh, I don't really want to go back to the resort. You know, I want to just be in the parks and, you know, take advantage of being there and, and all that. But when I do get to the lodge, it's like, um, I just, I, I honestly kind of just love being there too. You know, like I've talked about before, just kind of veg and relax and chilling out and uh, taking it all in. And these activities are a really fun way for not only adults, but especially children to uh, learn different things and have fun Have fun doing that too. And um, yeah, it's cool. And it's a good break from them from the parks. You know, I probably ain't telling you guys anything you don't know already. But um, all right. Well, I hope you enjoyed the mini series on Animal Kingdom Lodge over the past three episodes. I've enjoyed doing them for the most part. You know, aside from the green screen issue, <laughs> which I'm still trying to work out. We'll see what happens on the next show. I do not know what I'm doing on show 71. I will start to think about that now, I guess, after I put this show out. And uh, we'll go from there. I have actually a pretty decent idea. Uh, I haven't done one in a while, so um, I'm looking forward to maybe getting that, getting that out too. So, um... Very cool. Uh, thank you, as always, for watching the show and uh, hanging out with me. And um, I really appreciate everybody's time doing that. So I'm going to get on with the rest of the show. I'm not sure what segment. I think I'm going to go right to the character classified segment. And uh, we got a What the Diz and, you know, all the good cheesy stuff coming up. So enjoy this episode, and I will see you on the next video cast beyond street number 71 all right everybody have a great week and uh send me your comments if you enjoyed the mini series um let me know if you have any thoughts what you might want to see down the road shortly uh let me know all right i will definitely take it in consideration and give it a try so uh i can at least promise you that might not be able to do it but we'll we'll see what happens you guys have a great week. Hope you're enjoying your summer. And uh, Jumbo, we will see you on the next video cast. Everybody take care now. Bye-bye. Enjoy the rest of the show.
Well, all right, everybody. I hope you enjoyed this episode of the Beyond Main Street video cast. I wanted to leave you with some simple information to send me feedback or to uh, leave comments. You could follow me on plurk.com, twitter.com, and dizfriends.com. Simply, my name is BMS Lou. You could also come over and be my friend on Facebook. My name is Lou Moulton. And uh, most importantly, I really appreciate any emails and contact that I get regarding shows or suggestions and comments. Uh, so send me an email at beyondmainstreet at gmail.com. I, uh, I am very appreciative of everybody who follows me on all of these sites, as well as uh, any comments that I get regarding the show. So I'm having a lot of fun doing these for you guys. I'm doing my best, and I, can, I hope to continue to uh, entertain you. Uh, a long time down the road. So everybody have a great week and we'll see you on the next vidcast. Take care.